In previous video, you learned how to add and subtract the matrices. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to multiply a matrix by a number. Multiplication of a matrix by a number is known as scalar multiplication. Let us look at example 1. Given that P equals negative 2, 5, edge 1, calculate 2P. Two 2P two means to multiply the matrix P. So now you multiply all the elements by 2. So 2 times negative 2. 2 times 5. 2 times add. And also 2 times 1. Negative 4, 10, 16, 2. B. Negative 1 over 2 times P. Now you multiply all the elements by negative 1 over 2. So negative 1 over 2 times negative 2 equals 1. Negative 1 over 2 times 5, we can write as improper fraction, negative 5 over 2. Negative 1 over 2 times add equals negative 4. And negative 1 over 2 times 1 equals negative 1 over 2. To know further, let us look at example 2. Given that matrix P is 1 and matrix Q is 1, calculate 5 bracket matrix P minus matrix Q. So how to do it? Very simple. Just write like this. 5 and draw a big bracket inside the bracket. Metric P minus metric Q. Okay, so now we need to solve the element in the bracket. Of course, you need to find the corresponding element. So 4 minus 2, seven minus negative 1, 8 minus 7, Two minus five, negative three minus six, nine minus negative five.
So we continue. Okay, so 4 minus 2 is 2. 7 plus 1 add. Add minus 7, 1. 2 minus 5 is negative 3. Negative 3 minus negative 6 is negative 9. 9 plus 5 is 14. Last step, all the elements in the bracket multiplied by 5. 5 times 2, 10. 5 times 8, 40. 5 times 1, 5. 5 times negative 3, negative 15. 5 times negative 9, negative 45. And 5 times 14 equals 70. Now we look at example 3. A given that 1 over 2, 4, 12 minus S, negative 3 equals 5, Y. Calculate the value of S and Y. So first I copy down the equation. Next, we multiply the element by 1 over 2. 1 over 2 times 4 equals 2. 1 over 2 times 12 equals 6. The other we just copy down. So we do the subtraction. Two minus s six minus negative three equals five y. Okay, so now we need to find the value of s and y. So I take out the corresponding elements to find the value of s. 2 minus s equals 5. So I move over the number. Negative s equals 5 minus 2. Negative s equals 3. s equals negative 3. The next one, 6 minus negative 3 equals y. So I write the element outside the bracket. Negative, negative, positive. So 6 plus 3 equals y. y equals 9. Okay, now B, 4R plus 902 negative 3 equals negative 3, 4, 10, 1. Calculate the metric R. Here, metric R is a metric 2 by 2. If metric R not a metric 2 by 2, you cannot add and obtain the answer in order 2 by 2. Okay, this one you must understand. Okay, copy down the question first. First, I will move this metric to the right hand side. Opposite of plus is minus. So for R equals negative 3, 4, 10, 1, 
minus nine zero to negative three. R equals you do the subtraction of these two matrices negative three minus nine equals negative twelve four minus zero equals four ten minus two is eight one minus negative three equals four move over four to opposite side okay so this one four when you move over it will become one over four so r r equals one over four times negative twelve four at four okay so here teacher want to mention you don't do like this negative 12 4 at 4 divided by 4 uh, so move this one the 4 to the front you just put 1 over 4 like what teacher did just now okay so this one don't do Now multiply all the elements by 1 over 4. R equals 1 over 4 times negative 12 equals negative 3. 1 over 4 times 4 equals 1. 1 over 4 times h equals 2. And 1 over 4 times 4 equals 1. Okay, now we look at last example. The average number of vehicles per day in a parking area for five working days is represented in table S. Table Y represents the average number of vehicles per day on weekend. Calculate the number of vehicles parked at the parking area in a week. Okay. First, you must know 5 working day, so you times 5. And weekend, we have 2 days, so times 2. So how to do it? Okay, table S, let's say, table S, we write in matrix is, because 5 days, so 5 times 42, at 2011 plus weekend is two days right so two times 25 5 12 3 now for this metric every element multiplied by 5 so we will obtain 42 5 times 42 is 210 5 times add equals 40 5 times 20 equals 100 and 5 times 11 equals 55 For the next metric here, also, also all the elements multiplied by 2. 2 times 25, 50. 2 times 5, 10. 2 times 12, 24. 2 times 3, 6. So you add these two matrices. You will obtain 
260, 50, 124, and 61. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy learning through my video. Please subscribe my channel and don't forget click the bell so that you can receive the latest notification. See you.